Good day to everyone. Welcome back to my channel Matinix and more. Today our problem is Adan can do a piece of work in three days, Bernie in four days, and Cynthia in six days, each working alone. How long will it take them to do it working together? Now this is our first problem in work problems involving rational algebraic expressions. And in this problem, it is a comparison of words of three persons, Ber uh, Adam, Bernie, and Cynthia. And we are required to solve how long it will take them to do the job working together. If you are excited to the solutions, let's go. But please don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. And hit the bell button for all so that you will be notified for all incoming videos. Work problems. Example number one. Adan can do a piece of work in three days, Bernie in four days, and Cynthia in six days. Each working alone. So, it, if they are working alone, Adan can do the job in three days, Bernie in four days, and Cynthia in six days. But if they will work together, how long will it take them to do? Then that is the required from the problems. Now, as I am what as what I am always telling you in solving worded problems, the first thing to do is take all the given. And the given here is Adan can do the job in three days, Bernie in four days, and Cynthia in six days. Now, so required is we are required to solve how long will it take them to do the same job. So, in our solution, let x be the number of days working together. And so, for our solution, Let's say 1 over 3. What is 1 over 3? Where did we get this? Since Adan can do the job in 3 days, therefore 1 over 3 is the job Adan did in 1 day. Because he can finish the job in three days, so one third is the job done for one day. And one over four is the job done by Bernie in one day. And one over six is the job done by Cynthia in one day and one over x is the job done in number of days for everybody for the three persons one over x is a job done in one day now let us simplify the equation. And in simplifying this 
equations, we need to find the least common denominator. And to get the least common denominator, let us just multiply their denominators. Or simply 12x multiplied by 1 over 3 plus 1 over 4 plus 1 over 6 is equal to 12x multiplied by 1 over x. Our least common denominator is 12x. Now, this 12x in left-hand side of the equation, we will distribute this in all terms inside the parentheses. 12x multiplied by 1 over 3 plus 1 over 4 plus 1 over 6 is equal to 1 over x multiplied by 12x. 12x multiplied by 1 over 3 12x multiplied by 1 over 3 plus 12x multiplied by 1 over 4 plus 12x multiplied by 1 over 6 is equal to 12 because x is cancelled. Okay? Now, let us simplify the equations. Let us cancel this 3 and then 12 will become 4. And cancel this 4 and 12 will become 3. And 6 cancelled and 12 will become 2. And it is equal to 12. Simplifying further, we have 4x plus 3x plus 2x is equal to 12. Or simply 4x plus 3x plus 2x is equal to 12. And we have this 9x is equal to 12 x is equal to 12 over 9 or 1 yeah x is equal to 12 over 9 days or equal to 1 and 1 third now let us check the if our answer is correct we can simplify this as one day and one over three. Okay. Now, let us check our answer if it is correct. Let's go back to the equation. One third plus one fourth plus one over six is equal to one over 12 over 9 or simply 4 over 12 is equal uh, plus 3 over 12 plus 2 over 12 is equal to 9 over 12 or simply 9 over 12 is equal to 9 over 12 Therefore, our answer as 9 over 12 is correct. Or, our answer for the number of days is equal to 12 over 9, or simply one day and one third day. And the 
before I end this video, I'm going to share with you one verse from the Bible, Jeremiah 29, verse 11. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you a hope and a future. Thank you very much and God bless us all. Bye-bye.